to continue vetting the 51 permanent secretaries nominated by President William Ruto after the petitions presented against their nomination were dismissed. Judge Nduma Nderi has dismissed petitions filed by the Law Society of Kenya, LSK, and two other parties, noting that they were presented prematurely. 14 days after the court gave a temporary injunction stopping the vetting process of the 51 permanent secretaries nominated by President William Ruto, on Tuesday, Justice Nduma Nderi okayed the parliament to continue vetting Ruto's nominees. While issuing the order, Judge Nderi said that the court will review some of the issues presented by the Law Society of Kenya, LSK, after the National Assembly concludes the vetting process. In its application, LSK told the court that the appointment did not consider regional balance. In its pleadings to the council, Watchdog also asserted that the nomination by the president didn't meet the two-thirds rule, people living with disability and the youth. Before suspending the process, 22 out of the 51 permanent secretaries were already vetted by the respective committees of parliament. They include former IEBC director for ICT James Muhati, who has been nominated as PS for economic planning, current Labour PS Peter Tum, nominated as medical services PS, and former Laikipia West member of parliament Patrick Mariro. All right, moving on, let's uh, look at... Um the story about how a middle-aged man